Hi, this is Whitney Dubinsky, and welcome to the video blog for the Dubinsky's Travels. Um, today, I'm going to be unboxing my first ever subscription box, Stitch Fix. For those of you who don't know, this is our first video blog, so bear with me. I've never done this before, but I am going to walk you through this process of Stitch Fix, as well as why it works for me and why I think it might work for you. I began using Stitch Fix about two years ago. I was looking for new and inventive ways to improve my wardrobe. I'm a bit petite, I'm five foot one, and I have found that clothes sometimes don't fit so good, fit so well, and I wanted to make sure that I was dressing for my body and not just for the body of the mannequin out there. So I started subscribing to a couple of these types of services that do personal shopping for you. For those of you who are new to Stitch Fix, what it is is five pieces for clothing, one accessory that is sent to you each month that you can return if you don't like, and there's a discount if you purchase all five items. So I'm gonna walk you through the process and the pieces I'm gonna keep and the pieces I'm gonna send back this month for my July unboxing video of Stitch Fix. So first and foremost, my favorite element of the Stitch Fix box is the information card. Basically what the information card does is tell you not only what items are in your box, but how to dress them, style them, and then even in some cases what articles of clothing you can pair them with. So as you can see from this one, I got this cardigan we're going to talk about in a little bit, but I already have this black and white dress, so it's a nice suggestion about how I should wear them. It includes accessories as well and some shoes and other items. So what I gave Stitch Fix when I first signed up were my personal preferences, so the styles I like, the things I'm interested in, but also weather preferences as well as what dresses like in my work. So I work in a bit of a more casual environment, so I don't really have much need for suits and fancy items. Uh, also, I live in West Africa, so I don't have need for very many uh, pairs of jeans, and I certainly don't need any winter apparel. So these are things I just constantly remind my personal stylist with Stitch Fix, and I've generally been really so now I'm going to walk you through the items I got this month. Um, I'm overall quite happy. I did open this box, so it's not a traditional, oh my god, unboxing video. But I am going to show you what I like and what I don't like. So this is the first piece. It's a dress. It's a great pattern. It is brought to you by Market and Spruce. It is a midi dress, which means it's going to go down to about my mid-half. Um, it's a simple dress, but it's a great pattern, and I really like it, and it work, will work really well here in West Africa. In addition, I got this really cute top. So this flannel top that has a really nice cut um, down the middle, and it's also sleeveless, which means I can wear it anywhere and be really comfortable here. Also, they included a very casual but still incredibly nice purple and teal print long sleeve shirt, which is perfect for work. It is a very lightweight material. I don't know if you can tell that here, but it is going to make um, dressing up a nice skirt or even dressing down with a, a good, nice pair of jeans really, really fashionable. The last piece of clothing I received, I sadly am not a big fan of, but that's not their fault. It's just not my style. It's a cardigan with a kind of bizarro zipper thing very possible this is the fashion. I don't live in the United States, so this could be the new knit it thing, but sadly it's not going to work for me here. Also, it's a bit of a thick sweater. This month's accessory was super cute. I think it's going to be really cute. Here it is. It is a bangle in multicolors. It's rose gold, brass, and silver. I really like it. I like that it allows you to pair it with any type of metal that you're currently wearing. And it's just a nice little cute accessory. I don't usually like the accessories they put in the box, but this time I'm really happy. Now Stitch Fix has an interesting setup that you get a 20% discount on all the items if you purchase everything. Uh, however, sometimes that means it's cheaper to keep uh, pieces in your um, Stitch Fix that you don't, wouldn't necessarily keep. So for instance, it's gonna end up being cheaper if the only item I don't want is the sweater for me to keep it. In fact, I have the prices in front of me. The sweater itself is $68, and if I purchase the entire Stitch Fix, it's $184 for me. But if I send something back and lose the discount, merchandise total is $272. So $272 minus $68 is 
clearly going to be more than 184. You like how I avoided doing the math? I'm an economist. I probably should have done that math. If my dad's watching, I'm sorry, dad. Um, but it is going to be cheaper for me to keep the cardigan. Um, for those who are very severe or really interested in Stitch Fix, there are some buy-sell trade sites that you can go on to so you can trade the items. Uh, for you fashionistas out there, just so you know, the brands on these are Zad, Market and Spruce, and Movem. And I will put all the links down below. Ooh, kind of scary uh, concept. In addition, for those of you who live abroad like I do, return items are really easy. They give you a bag that's already got the postage fully on it. So anything you don't want, you just stick in the bag and put in the mail. And frankly, this is easier than Amazon or anything else that you don't even have to print anything out. So I've been a really big fan of this service so much so that we went to find one that um, complement uh, that's available for men, and we will be doing a further update later in the month on Bombfell, which we found for my husband and his body type. Thank you very much for logging on to my first vlog video, video, my first unboxing video. Please leave suggestions. Be nice. It's my first one, and I don't know how to edit videos, so anything I say this time is stuck in this video. Have a great day.